Welcome back guys to a another Farmer's Dynasty and thank god it is not raining today so well as you can see in the thumbnail we uh had a massive update in here and before I get talking to you too much about it we have some stuff we have to go check out uh, there was a machine DLC come to the place or come to farmers there was a uh, let's see let's see we got eggs yeah we got eggs uh, there was uh, vegetables uh, potatoes and beets and with the potatoes and beets Toplips decided to add a new building. Well, they added a new building, all right, right on top of where we parked our <laughs> our plow, our cultivator, and our uh, lawn or our mower. Morning, Thomas. And so. We had to do some finagling to get some, or to get it out. And now we will be milking our cows. I just didn't want to do this since it's the first time that we're going to be milking them. Uh, without you guys. But, uh, with the new pack, now, yes, it costs some money. And it wasn't that much, it was less than $10 American. Which, you got both of them. Now, you don't have to buy the DLC if you don't want to. The only perk in it is you get a brand new tractor. Now, the tractor is not down here. That is up where we left off in the last episode. Because we're going to go get our manure spreader. Now, I will show you the beat or the new building and there's our potato and beet silo now if you can remember we had to plow parked probably about right here we had the cultivator parked right here but then let me see if I can get up over this there we go right here is where the mower was. I was worried about the corn header, but we could get in there just fine with the harvester and pick that up. So while I'm down here, um, to get the mower out, I did have to call a tow truck, which sucked because I had to spend two hundred dollars. And ooh. I wonder, what if I left this? Can I open these? Oh. oh, okay. So yeah, let's go ahead and open these up for a little while. We'll check it when we get back home. Just so that way... We can get that down a little bit. Get it a little fresh air in here. Might be good for our plants. I knew. Come on, what is that thing? There is a secret, or not a secret, but something I did figure out when it comes to mushrooms. Um, you know, I've talked about it in the past where it's hard to see the mushrooms because of the marker they have for them, the green. Well, last night, it was dark out. I happened to come across a couple. And in the road. So I jumped out. And it was late. It was like 7 o'clock. Maybe 8. It was getting a little dark. Oh well, yeah that worked. 
So now we gotta shut all these back down again. Or you know what? Dang it. Alright, now I'm not too sure about these things. Let's see, come on. I hit E. Where is the hitbox? Um, so anyway, well, uh, so they're in the road and I was like, alright, I'll jump off and pick them up real quick. Well, then I got looking. And found out that the best time of day to uh, go mushroom hunting would be when it's dark out or getting dark you know the sun's not shining too bright because then what it does is it turns the grass to a darker green which makes it easier to see the light green for the mushrooms I will show you what I mean there I mean, and I don't know if it's going to be this one, this episode, or not, but I will show you what I mean, either this one or the next episode, depending on how late it gets today. Now, the Jack Bear, or not the Jack Bear, but the new tractor, was parked. Now, like I was saying, you won't get that if you don't buy the DLC. You'll have to buy it from the store. Whereas when you buy the DLC, they give it to you for free, and it is parked normally right here. But as you can see, it's not here because I went through, and that's what I used to get all the you know, get the plow, the cultivator, and the mower out of the jam. And then afterwards, I drove that up because it'll be easier. Instead of driving the Jack Bear all the way up there. And remember, we got the fertilizer, too. Instead of driving this all the way up here, after we did the fertilizer haul, we'd just hop back in, you know, cheat a little bit, hop back in on this tractor, hook onto our manure spreader, and go home. And this tractor is a born special 281. Uh, I've heard that it was ported over from Lumberjack Dynasty, which is another game top with studs. So. Yeah, there's our new tractor. It's the same, basically the same thing, just different look. And different make and model and all that. So, without further ado, let's get into seeing what yes, it's going to take anything? to get Looking this manure spreader. Actually, I could use that manure spreader over there. Interested? Know anything about construction? Repairs? Sure, I'm quite skilled. Good to hear. All right, uh, I'm in between travels, and these buildings need a lot of work. Fix them for me, and the spreader's yours. Sure. Sounds fair. Will do. That's good. Now, which building I gotta fix first? This one? Oh, I'll get our trusty old nail gun out, and... And that's it's like it's just gonna be... Oh, there's some. So while we're doing this, I'm going to go into a time lapse, and I will see you guys when we're all done. I'll probably drive the Jack Bear back home and come back and get the uh, the bone. So and I'm probably mispronouncing that, but I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm not really good with words, so. Here we go. Just what I was thinking. I will see you guys later.
Okay. Um, I didn't do the roof. But, uh, yeah. That's something interesting. Sorry about that. I had a phone call. Alright. Now, let's talk to. Good as new. What's Good. His name? Looks solid. <laughs> Alright, take the spreader. Sure. Thanks. Let's see. Anyway. Frank? So now we have a manure spreader. Yeah, that bothers me that. I didn't get to do the roof. There's my OCD. So we're gonna hook this up. Let you guys hear it run for a little bit. Then we're gonna hop on the Jack Bear and we're gonna go home. Um, probably. Oops. Come on. Okay, now there's our Manera Spreader and the new Jack Bear. Now, I will see you guys oops, when we get home. Uh, it's gonna be a little while. I'm gonna bring this home and the more. So. Uh, as of right now, the only thing we have left to do, oh, what's this, spicy pumpkin soup, we don't have any pumpkins at the moment, fix a building, you know what, we might run over and do that, just so we can get some money and, you know, a little more money and whatnot, let's see, it's down here, yeah, we're gonna go, uh, so today we're pretty much gonna do that. I really should start or really should get that harvest and sold off, but That could be another day once we get everything done. That's a transport job. I really don't want to do I think that's all we got for jobs out here at the moment So I'm going to like I said, I'm gonna go do that and then, uh, that looks like Oliver. Uh, then on the way home from this quest, might stop by the store and show you the new, the new equipment that came in with the new DLC. Um, next episode, we will go down and get our. Actually, next episode we will probably get right into harvesting the granola. Let's see what the prices are doing now. Still 635. We'll check it again tomorrow. Hopefully they don't change. Um, I don't want to get a new silo. Where's the mill? There's the mill. Yeah, 682. I don't remember what we sold the weed off. I think it was 582. So yeah, well, let me get over there, get that going, and get some social points, get a little bit of money, and I'll see you over there. Guys, looks like we have made it over here um, in one piece. Let's see uh, which one we we have to do here. Howdy. Hi. Good morning. Okay. 
Nice weather, ain't it? It sure is. I am looking for this. work. Got anything for me? No, not at the moment. Okay, so you're not the guy that wants me. So. Thanks. I'll see you around. Huh. Well, let's see. This is the right spot, ain't it? Behind us. Oh, oh boy. Huh. I went away a well. Fix one building. Yeah, where? Is that you? Not now, sorry. Nope, it's you. We'll talk later. Uh, no, we're gonna talk now. Hi there. Good morning. Uh, let's see. Uh, Is there something I can help you with? I'll A building this. on my farm needs some care. What do you think? 400 euro? <laughs> yeah. Sounds good. I'll take care I of mean, this. I mean, we're only making 200 because we lost 200 from them. But, hey, let's get into it. There's only one building. It don't look that bad. So, let's see. We'll go right ahead and do this. Now... Yeah, I want to get into doing some more jobs for people. Um, I'm going to try, if we get back early enough to the uh, farm, which probably mean that I won't get the manure spreader or the new tractor down to the farm today. But, uh... You had to put a tall fence there. Um, if Oliver still has that transport job, I might take the pickup over. Check our luck, see if it's gonna drive our right this time around. It's not raining, so it shouldn't affect us that much. You know what I mean? I mean, I know last I or yesterday it was pretty horrible driving by me but I doing this with just a keyboard and mouse so just gotta keep reminding myself little little corrections you know let's see let's put everything in there dang door oh wow I thought she said a little work. <laughs> ah, this it really ain't that bad. The last one was pretty good. Anyway, look at that. Uh, I do, like I said, I want to get, I'm not sure if the new potatoes and uh, beets are winter crops, so I'm not going to mess with them until next season uh, next spring so I'm still gonna go with barley and canola in those two fields I'll probably look at it and whatever one's the bigger but now see that's a double edged sword because yeah while the prices of uh, the prices are doing good now we had no idea what it's going to do in uh, the spring. So it may end up hurting. You can't be sure about that. 
but uh oops, wrong button. It might change for the better somehow. I mean Pretty much I'm gonna do the same thing we did over there. Jump off the roof onto the other roof and so we may not get a good price and uh, the spring, but it's a risk I'm gonna take. So let's see. Drop down here. Get these bumped up a little bit. There we go. That is finished. I'm gonna go talk to her. Or talk to Nalia. Nalia. Thank you. Here's something for you. Well, thank you very much. And I'm really not in the mood today. That just got us 800 source points, 400 euros. Anytime, dear. Anytime. So, actually, I think. I'm going to uh, call this an episode. So, wait, no, I'm not. I'm going to show you guys around. So I will see you down when we get down to the equipment store. Okay guys, I believe this is the one that uh, has the new equipment, so we will, uh, yeah, I think so, okay let's see, what do we got here, what's, what's this, yep that's a new one, we will go in here, hey, I don't know if uh, I want to do that Right away, it's gonna be a while before we get something like that. Um, we got that. What's this boxer? That's really not bad. But we already got a mower. Um, this is a new uh, trailer. Get out of that. I don't think that is either. Okay. That's a new potato harvester we got. That's really not that bad. I'm just gonna have to do pretty good in the everything. There's another trailer. Uh, there's a cedar, which I don't see here, so, no, I'm sorry about that, my dog's walking around, can't bumping into my thing, so yeah, now I'm gonna leave you at this, let's see what it's worth, that's worth $6,000, very tempting, very tempting. That's our Jack Bear, which I know I said I owed nine thousand. Yeah, no, no, we're keeping her. So yeah, that's where we're gonna hit leave off, and uh, we will see you guys in the next episode. Bye for now.